Alright, welcome back uh, to the uh, series of screencasts on Zscaler. This one is addressing um, the global whitelist and the global blacklist and the site whitelist and site blacklist. A number of people have said to me, oh look, you know, I can't edit that, I'm not a super user, only super users can edit site white and blacklist. And that's actually not the case. Um, and what we'll do in this session is show you how that works. So basically, we go to manage. And it come up. Okay. Now, what people are saying to me is, "Oh, look, there's a little uh, thing on the side here. They're actually blocked. They're they're locked. And in actual fact, they are locked. You can't see it on this screen. They are locked, but they're only locked to editing from this screen. And this is not where you edit those policies. So, how do I do that? Well, let's have a look here. The global blacklist is the first rule to be executed." The global whitelist is the next rule to be executed. So let's say we want to permit something. So what we'll do is we'll go to URL categories. Now this is where you've got to go to. You don't edit it from this screen here. All right, and we scroll down to, hang on, I'll just change the screen width so we can see it a bit. Okay, go click on edit. come down here to user defined so that's where these lists are defined and then you've got the global whitelist global blacklist and remember I'm just a site administrator I want to add something into the whitelist I just click on that and I want to add something like blogspot or something like that so I just go dot which means wildcard so everything dot blog dot com dot au all right, I'm going to save that. All right, that's done. It's sitting in there now. Take a tag. So we can just click on done. Click on activate now. So that rule is now activated. So basically, what we what we're doing here is um, you don't edit that. URL policy page, you actually edit the category and you put the things in the category. So anyway, I hope that clears things up and uh, I hope uh, you enjoy it. Thanks for that. Bye.